Hey everyone, Tragic here, and I just got done with my patron rewards video, and I had one pack of Throne of Eldraine left, and Packbot here says uh, that I need more content, so I probably better open it, and also this Throne of Eldraine bundle to go with it. So here's 11 boosters of Throne of Eldraine to open right now. Let's get into it. Ah, that didn't go well. Here we go. Let's open this up. Had a lot of fun opening packs for patrons. Um, some of them made out pretty good, I think. I hope. Hope they liked it. Um, I like uh, these fat pack bundle boxes, so I'll probably end up keeping this one. I don't think I need that part that goes in there. But it's stuck in there, so I'm going to leave it. Um, let's take a look here. The spin downs being much bigger. I'm a huge fan of this. Um, very cool. So that's a keeper. We got here some foil, actual bundle promo card there. That's kind of cool. I have to open that one up and see what's in there. And we got a nice little deck box with 10 packs in it and some ways to spend more money with Wizards of the Coast, right? So I think I do enough of that already. Oh yeah, and as always, why do they keep giving us these filler boxes that don't fit your cards in any way other than this, which is incorrect. So I'd like to see them make that change at some point eventually. They put the you know the planeswalker symbol on there. That's that's great. What are you gonna do? Keep your one dice in there or whatever? I guess that's probably the idea. Anyway, here's the last pack. Um, from my patron rewards video, which was essentially a full box. I gave, opened up 35 packs. Someone got an Oko, so that was pretty cool. Let's see what this last pack was going to be. I'm going to go through the commons pretty quick here. And look at the uncommons. Got an Overwhelmed Apprentice, a Spinning Wheel, a Grumgully the Generous, and a Castle Ardenvale. So, uh, looks like the patrons got all the good stuff from that box, and I'm happy about that. So... Next up is my fat pack packs. How well can I do? Can I get another Oko? If I do, can I sell it fast enough before it gets banned? This and other questions will be answered right now by flipping this pack over. Um, that was weird that the token was the, on the end like that. Or was it? They're always like that. Hypnotic Sprite. Giant Opportunity, Order of Midnight, and a Witch's Vengeance. There we go. Okay. Yes, the token is at the end. <laughs> I should know this, right? Blow your house down. Take that however you want. Into the story, Clockwork Servant, Steel Claw, Lance, I saw a blue... Legendary, is it a Gadwick? Nope, it's an Emery Lurker of the Lock. That's solid right there. Okay. This is throwing me off that the token is like that. Oh, I gotta foil something. See, I don't wanna spoil it. Thrill of possibility. So the it's funny, the cards from the bundle feel a little slicker than the the cards from the booster box. Hmm, what is that all about? Claim the Firstborn, Venerable Knight, Beanstalk Giant, and a Castle Lockthwain, and a Foil Fairy Vandal. Alright, decent. Next up. Unexplained Vision. Embereth Shieldbreaker, Wintermore Commander, Falmire Knight in uh, alternate storybook art. That's really cool. I don't know if I've actually seen, like, looked up close at that. That is great. And I got a Dance of the Mance. Dance of the Mance. I'm going to put this one here. And I'll scan it up later, as I often do. I'm going to open up my promo pack here. I like the art there. Better than the original art for Piper of the Swarm. Uh, it's not really a big card, so it must have 
felt good about giving you this as a bundle promo. <laughs> Piper of the Swarm, and then you got some foil basic lands, which that's cool. Uh, three of each, like one of each art. Four, yeah, that's four islands there, that's cool. Um, these are great. I'm happy that they're giving these out instead of just a full bundle of basic non-foil lands. It's a nice little bit of value there. So, you got that. I'll throw this in here. Throw those ones there. These are the regular lands. They're going to go back there. Sure, yeah. Here, pack button. Hang on to that thing. All right, next pack. I'm going on an adventure. Foreboding fruit. The secret keeper. The secret is they're going to mill you to death. Sage of the Falls. Red cap melee. Witch's oven. Is there a cat in there? It looks like it's cooking right now. Sundering stroke is the rare. That's nothing. Next pack. Barge right in. Didn't say please. Spinning wheel. Arcanist's owl. Trail of crumbs. We got another legendary. It's an ember cleave. All right. Pretty solid mythic right there. Very, very useful piece of equipment there. All right. The Raging Red Cap. Not just a regular red cap. He's raging. Mostly he raged. Slaying Fire. Glass Casket. Cauldron Familiar. Right out of the oven. Ding. And a Wish Claw Talisman. That's a cool one too. Ogre Errant in Foil. Seven dwarves. Get all seven of them. Slaying fire. I always slay. Savvy hunter. A beanstalk giant with the alternate border. And a robber of the rich. So there's a couple mythics in this bundle right here. There you go. Who are these guys? Welcome to a new world of competitive magic. Javier Dominguez won a hundred grand? This is a kid's game. You giving away that kind of money for this? That's awesome. Smitten Swordmaster. Oh, it's so tiny. That's a tiny one there. Eye Collector. Into the story. Oak Hame Ranger. Cauldron Familiar again. And a Fay of Wishes. Ooh, and a Foil Animating Fairy. Last pack. For this bundle, I really need an Oko. I need to turn around and sell it immediately before it gets banned. Mystic Sanctuary. Opt. Venerable Knight. Witches Oven again. Arcanist Owl. Return of the Wild Speaker. He's back. Don't call it a comeback. And there's a food token for you. All right, I'll scan these up real quick and see how I did. Okay, I'm back, but first I wanted to show off the inside of this bundle uh, package, this cool artwork by Seb McKinnon with your, this poor knight who has a spirit walk, watching over him. Very cool. Love it. I'm keeping this as a souvenir. So there we go. Let's scan it up. I already scanned my Piper of the Swarm. It's the bundle version. It's a buck fifteen. So here's a Foulmire Knight. Showcase version, 54 cents. There we go. A beanstalk giant is 44. Witch's Vengeance. Witch's Vengeance. There you go. 299. That's not the promo pack. It's a regular one and it's a lot less. So there we go. Castle Ardenvale. Castle Lockthwain. That's a bit more. Buck 99. Dance of the Mance. 91 wish claw talisman there's a buck fey of wishes also a buck return of the wild speaker 
couple bucks there. No, it's not the promo version. Good old TCG app sometimes doesn't know what it's doing. A sundering stroke. Emery, Lurker of the Lock is pretty good. 647. An Ember Cleave, 10 bucks. And a Robber of the Rich, $4 there. So 30 bucks back on my 40 bucks on this bundle. Uh, plus one pack. So not great. But I got a couple cool cards out of it and I had a lot of fun. And Packbot was also here. And you guys were also here as well. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. Comment down below. Do all the things and have a good one.